माई सेल्फ डॉक्टर साधना सिंह एसोसिएट प्रोफेसर इन केमिस्ट्री एस एम बी गवर्नमेंट कॉलेज नादवारा टूडे आई विल टीच सेकेंड ईयर ऑर्गेनिक केमिस्ट्री चैप्टर दैट इज पॉली न्यूक्लियर हाइड्रोकार्बन्स द पॉली न्यूक्लियर हाइड्रोकार्बन्स मीन्स द हाइड्रोकार्बन्स विच हैव एरोमेटिक रिंग्स मोर देन वन दैट इज मोर देन वन एरोमेटिक रिंग्स दे आर ऑफ टू टाइप्स आइसोलेटेड एंड फ्यूज पॉली न्यूक्लियर आइसोकार्बन एंड आइसोलेटेड पॉली न्यूक्लियर हाइड्रोकार्बन द एग्जाम्पल्स आर डाइफेनाइल डाइफेनाइल मिथेन ट्राइफेनाइल एक्सेट्रा एंड इन द फ्यूज पॉली न्यूक्लियर हाइड्रोकार्बन द एग्जाम्पल्स आर नेप्थलीन एंथ्रासन फिनथ्रीन टेट्रासन पेंटासन एक्सेट्रा द आइसोलेटेड पॉली न्यूक्लियर हाइड्रोकार्बन्स दे हैव द सेम नेचर स्ट्रक्चर एंड प्रॉपर्टीज लाइक बेनजीन बट इन द फ्यूज पॉली न्यूक्लियर हाइड्रोकार्बन्स दे हैव डिफरेंट टाइप ऑफ प्रॉपर्टीज ऑल्सो अफकोर्स दे आर एरोमेटिक नाउ विल स्टडी द नेप्थलीन नेप्थलीन हुज मॉलिकुलर फॉर्मूला इज सी टेन एच एट and the structure given is this one where two benzene rings are attached at one to position or you can say that they are ortho to each other to confirm this structure of benzene given we will study following things for the structure of naphthalene first of all the molecular formula of when naphthalene is c10h8 which has lesser number of hydrogen atoms than carbon atoms this shows that the naphthalene is an unsaturated compound that it has double bond or triple bond because the naphthalene is an unsaturated compound and it doesn't give addition reactions it gives electrophilic substitution reactions it means it is an aromatic compound or it has aromatic behavior similar like benzene to confirm it to confirm its structure if you oxidize the naphthalene with kno4 in the presence of acid it gives thalic acid the formation of thalic acid from naphthalene shows that it has at least one benzene ring and the another ring is fused at one and two position because the two carboxyl groups are ortho to each other the another ring the second ring is also aromatic or not for this we study this reaction see this reaction in this naphthalene is nitrated it gives nitronaphthalene this nitronaphthalene if oxidized then we know that the nitro group deactivate the ring so if we oxidize then we get the nitrothalic acid the formation of nitrothalic acid shows that the benzene ring on which nitro group is present is aromatic so if this ring is aromatic on which the nitro group is present then whether another ring is aromatic or not to say it again we take them this nitronaphthalene first we reduce it to amino naphthalene now we know that amino group which this act, the, the amino group activate the benzene ring so now if we oxidize this amino naphthalene it gives thalic acid this shows that the ring which is not having nitro group is also aromatic and it means both the rings of naphthalene 1 and 2 both are aromatic in character also the structure of naphthalene is planar and having resonating structure like this 1 2 3 etc the resonating energy of naphthalene is 61 kilo calorie per mole we know that the resonating energy of benzene ring is 36 kilo calorie per mole 
and in naphthalene if there are two benzene rings then it kilo cal the resonating energy of it is it must be near about 72 kilocalorie but it is 61 kilocalorie per mole this shows that benzene naphthalene is not as stable as benzene also in naphthalene the cc bond lengths are of two type the c1 and c2 is of 1.36 pi armstrong and c2 and c3 is of 1.404 armstrong all are not equally equal the molecular orbital concept of naphthalene shows that each carbon atom is sp2 hybridized thus having three sigma bonds and one p orbital with one pi electron the p orbitals in naphthalene overlap to each other to give the delocalized system and it gives the electron cloud above and below the plane of the ring so the naphthalene who has a planar structure who has delocalized pi electron system also following the huckel rule that is 4n plus 2 pi electron rule it are because it has in 10 pi electrons so it is aromatic compound with two fused benzene like, like rings at one and two pos position or ortho to each other so this is all about the structure of naphthalene now we will study in another lecture about synthesis and properties of naphthalene thank you